Hey, everybody. Can you hear me okay? Yeah? Good? All right. Uh, hi. Hello. My name is Tiffany Burns. I'm the publicist for the Calgary International Film Festival. And today, uh, we'd like to welcome our Calgary media for coming out to this announcement and also our Facebook live stream viewers. Thanks for tuning in on the internet. As you can see, um, you might be able to tell we are on set of a Calgary television show and I will let our next speaker explain just exactly why we're here. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce Steve Schrader, Executive Director of the Calgary International Film Festival. Steve? Thank you, Tiffany. Again, can everybody hear me all right? Coming through? Uh, it's not every day, as in fact, it's never a day <laughs> until today where we get to do an announcement from uh, a working film set, which is very exciting for us. And um, uh, so I would like to uh, thank and welcome all the Facebook Live viewers who are tuning in for this. And also thank you to um, a great a representation of our media who have come out uh, for this conference today. Thank you all for coming. Uh, this is the first, by the way, of many Calgary International Film Festival announcements we'll be making over the coming weeks. The festival itself is, uh, it starts September 21st, so we're just under two months away from it. It's announcement season. And uh, in fact, uh, you might want to be on the lookout later today for another announcement. It will be the announcement of our Alberta Spirit program, which includes our selection of all the best short films from Alberta from the past year. And those will be announced, that program will be announced later today. We'll also be announcing uh, our gala program, all of our gala feature films on August 17th. So those are just two of the special announcement date, uh, dates coming up. But today, there's a reason we're here on the set of, if you haven't guessed it, Heartland. Heartland being that amazing. Alberta produced, Alberta shot, uh, award-winning television show that that uh, that has that has been so wonderful wonderful for our our uh, our screen community here in, in Alberta and across the country. We're right here on the front porch of the ranch house, uh, which you see in almost every episode. But I'll get I'll get to that in a few minutes. Uh, first of all, a few general words about the Calgary International Film Festival. Uh, we've been very honoured to be a growing festival over the last several years. This, this coming September will be the 17th edition, but uh, last year we had a record audience uh, for the festival. That's been a trend that's been going on for a few years, and, we're, and it's, we're really delighted. We do it for the audience, after all, at the end of the day, and to connect, to connect the, the, the film and, and screen fans to, what we put, to, what we, to the amazing artists who work so hard to bring, to bring these stories to you. Um, and uh, Alberta content, uh, Alberta films and other Alberta screen content has always been a cornerstone of the festival. It's always been a very strong through line of everything we've presented. And looking ahead to what we want to do this year and in the coming years, um, we're we're tripling down on that. Uh, we know that there's an incredible thirst by our own Calgary and our own Alberta and our own Canadian audiences to really know uh, what's happening here. There's such excitement from, 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 the, from people involved in the industry all the way through to the general public for where Alberta's screen industry is going. And it's been a tremendous few years for us in the screen industry here, and, and we, we see that continuing. And so to, to, to celebrate that fan interest and that industry growth and excellence, um, this year we're going to be introducing a new program within the festival, a new series, if you will, called Alberta Scene. And that's going to bring together all of the on and off screen content that that, that the Calgary National Film Festival has always, has always championed into one, one um, much expanded, much strengthened program. Uh, there, it looks like we might have a record number of Alberta features, for example, this year at the festival, uh, among other storylines. So, uh, so there's lots of stories to celebrate and lots of things to connect the fans to within the, Al the new Alberta Scene program. And the marquee centerpiece of the Alberta Scene program this year is a new event that we're calling Showcase Alberta. And Showcase Alberta will be every year going forward now, starting this September, our celebration and our cities and our community celebration of the most outstanding um, uh, examples of excellence in the Alberta screen industry, uh, past and present. And we thought, what better way to do the inaugural Showcase Alberta event than with Heartland? Uh, Heartland 
is now the longest running one hour drama in Canadian television history. It's watched by over a million Canadians every episode. It's seen in, I think we lose count because it seems to be always changing, but 119 or so, and Tom in a minute, sorry, Tom in a minute can correct me if that's wrong, but it's licensed in 119 countries. The world watches this show. This is one of the most outstanding um, and, and, and celebrated and, and award winning shows in our nation's history. And so, uh, and it's from right here. It's produced, it's, it's shot uh, in southern Alberta. It's produced out of Calgary. And uh, of course, it's seen on CBC. So the first uh, annual Alberta Showcase event will be Showcase Alberta, celebrating a decade of Heartland. And that will take place on October 1st, which is the closing Saturday of the festival, at Flame Central. And that's an event where the general public and you, the fans, are invited to come along with, I think we're anticipating virtually all of the cast and crew to be present for that. That's going to include uh, the world premiere screening of the season 10 premiere episode. Uh, and a wonderful Q and A with with the cast and crew, and um, and the chant and lots of other treats from the show, and the chance for the general public and fans and and the curious to come and mingle and celebrate this incredible television and screen event uh, uh, with with the makers of the show and the incredible artists behind the show. So we're incredibly happy with this event uh, and to be doing it. So. Um, I would like to thank a few folks. There, we have a few partners already who have come on board for the event. Um, specifically, uh, well, 724 Films, who are the Calgary-based producers of Heartland, um, of course, for, 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 for enthusiastically accepting our invitation to be part of the Calgary National Film Festival this year. Alberta Film and the Government of Alberta um, are strong partners always, and on this specifically. The Canada Media Fund, the Canada Media Producers Association, and the Alberta Me Media um, Producers Industry Association, um, otherwise known as Ampia, are all uh, joining us to help celebrate and champion this show. So once again, for those of you who might have tuned in uh, 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 slightly after the beginning, I'm Steve Schrader. I'm the Executive Director of the Calgary International Film Festival. Thank you all for joining us. Now I'd like to introduce Tom Cox, who is the Executive Producer of Heartland, to say a few words. Hi, Tom. Hi. Thank you very much, Steve. You're welcome. And uh, welcome everyone uh, who is here uh, on the set of Heartland and those of you uh, watching from afar. It is such a pleasure to be here with you all uh, at the Heartland Ranch. Um, you probably will know if you watch the show where we are and, and what lies inside and maybe we'll be able to see a bit more of that later. Um, I am joined here today by our phenomenal showrunner Heather Conkeys principal reason why this is in its 10th year. And um, our producer, Jamie Paul Rock, I think Lorenz Augustine, our other producer is here as well. Um, and I want to talk a little bit about this event. We're thrilled to have been asked by the Calgary Inter International Film Festival to uh, be the recipients of this first inaugural um, showcase. Uh, it's such a fantastic pleasure and honor to be part of it. We're huge fans of this film festival. It is an amazing world-class festival, but it's also a phenomenal local resource. And I think the fact that people come out in droves to watch Alberta programming films and shorts and now television is testament to the fans of that festival here locally. Um, I want to talk a little bit about the event itself. It's going to be fantastic at, at Flame Central. As Stephen mentioned, there's going to be a red carpet, which I understand from our publicist Gordon will feature an appearance by Spartan, uh, which is kind of cool. <clears throat> uh, well, he is a main character. Uh, inside, Spartan will not, I think, come in and be <laughs> part of the festivities inside, uh, but he'll be available to answer questions outside after. Um, inside, we're going to have some of our key cast. Uh, of course, Amber Marshall, who plays Amy. Graham Wardle, Ty, Sean Johnson, Jack, and Alicia Newton plays Georgie, along with many of our department heads. We hope, as Stephen mentioned, uh, almost all the cast and crew will be there. There'll be a great question and answer afterwards. You'll be able to chat with everyone, and then a party, a great party. Um, and yes, we're thrilled to be part of it. Heartland is in its 10th season, bless its socks. We're thrilled to be uh, in our 10th season on CBC. We're thrilled to be part of this festival. Stephen, can't thank you enough.
Thanks so much, Tom. And uh, just before we wrap this up for our Facebook Live streaming viewers right now, just a couple of more things to reiterate here. First and foremost, tickets for this special Heartland Calgary International Film Festival event go on sale right now on our website. So go to calgaryfilm.com, snap them up. They are $45 and they are sure to sell out fast. Also, if you head to our website, you may notice that we already have festival passes and ticket packages on sale and early bird pricing is in effect until August 12th. So take advantage of that. And we are rolling out announcements from now right on up until the festival. So check back on our website, calgaryfilm.com, every Wednesday when we will be making announcements about all the fantastic screenings that you can expect at this year's festival, including a big one, August 17th. That's when we announce our galas. So Facebook Live viewers, thank you so much for tuning in today. And we'll see you back here in Calgary, September 21st for the Calgary International Film Festival. Thank you.